It was St. Bonaventure head women's soccer coach Manoj Ketri following a 2-1 Bonnie's win over Rhode Island. Uh, with the victory, you go to your fifth straight Atlantic 10 championship. We'll get to some of the minutiae of the game in a second. Just talk about that feeling. Uh, feels unbelievable. Um, you know, we're a man down, a goal down, um, going into the second half. And uh, to watch how hard our players played in the second half, I mean, I think the shot count was... 13 to 3 in the second half us that's down a player um, you know 45 minutes left in our season and uh, we scored two goals I thought we could have scored three or four more to be quite honest um, I just I don't think I've ever been more impressed with a team that I've coached um, in terms of effort and heart and character that was fantastic you, you mentioned down a man you're down a man down a goal going into the second half uh, how were you able to control the game, really, with 10 players on the field? You know, um, we just tried, uh, you know, what I told them at halftime is that we needed our outside backs to get into the attack. And, uh, you know, we were only playing with two forwards and that those two had to be a tandem. They had to play together. Um, you know, we had two kids up front, Molly and Britt, who are sophomores who have known each other, um, play well together. Um, and the two of them, you know, did an absolutely fantastic job being a partnership and being a tandem up front. I thought our midfield was fantastic and just outworked their midfield. Um, and then our outside backs, you know, Courtney and, and Mo just gave us so much attack out of the back and uh, with, and it, it just was a fantastic effort. Uh, the first goal, Brittany to Molly uh, off the goal kick there. Uh, the second goal, who, who better than uh, than Shannon? A great delivery from Brittany. Yep. Uh, but talk about how fitting it is that Shannon gets you into the postseason for the fifth straight year. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> you know, it is really fitting. I thought, um, you know, I thought she's been our best player all year. And, uh, you know, every A-10 coach that I've spoken to has, you know, talked about her quality. Um, yeah, I'm really happy for her, but, you know, really happy for this group, um, especially for the way our season started, how difficult of a non-conference season we had. Um, our approach was we want to prepare for conference, and, you know, the last three games have been unbelievably difficult. Um, you know what? They've been very dramatic. I mean, you couldn't ask for, uh, you know, a better script than uh, than what you saw play out here today. You mentioned the last three games. You enter the A-10 Championship on that three-game winning streak. Uh, obviously, that helps you. But kind of talk about carrying that momentum into next weekend. You know, I think we're a very confident team. I think that we're playing really well. I think we trust each other. I think we've kind of found our identity and, and who we are and how we want to play. Um, we're getting a lot of really quality minutes from a lot of players. Um, seems like we're getting players to step up right when they we need them to and uh, you know I saw that from some of the seniors today they were just fantastic right, thanks a lot coach good luck Thank